see them on team speed they have on offense. If you could, it's a little more like a track and field team. Have you ever seen anything like that? No, nah, no, nah, they got a lot of talent on the offensive side of the ball. And like you said, a lot of speed. They really do a good job like spreading the field out and making you tackle. So we got to be on our stuff this week. Greg, how's your mindset going against a quarterback who seems like he gets the ball in his hands very fast? What changes for you guys? Uh, you still want to go out there and win your one-on-one -on -one rushes. That what it, that's what it like always comes down to. You want to stop the run still. That remains the same. And then you want to affect the quarterback. Some games affecting the quarterback might be um, getting your hands up and tipping passes up. Or some games it might be uh, like sacks, like last week, just getting after somebody, a quarterback that holds the ball for a longer period of time or likes to push the ball down the field more. So, I mean, at the end of the day, you just got to find a way to do it, win your one-on-ones, and affect the quarterback in whichever way possible. Yeah, we've been playing some real solid ball on defense. But, I mean, every week at the same time is a new week, so we got to be able to hit that reset button. Uh, this week and just kind of just restart and build everything back up from the ground and get ready for get ready for Miami because they got a real nice offense. We saw Leonard, we saw Leonard make sacks on back to back plays against. Washington. Just what is it about him that allows him to be such a menace for opposing offensive lines? I mean, man, he if you watch him out here in practice, man, he goes hard all the time. He's always practicing his his techniques and just always just getting better, open minded. And he, he just goes hard out there. Like, you get rewarded when you're always going, always going full speed, always rushing. When you play the run, all that stuff, it, it comes back to you. So he's a great player. There's something that, I guess, goes – like, you guys see that and makes that makes you guys also want to go as hard as Leonard? I'd say we all feed off each other as a D-line. Like, all of us, when we're out there, we go hard. There's no drop-off from one person to the next. We all got that same kind of, like, blood flowing through our veins, just the way we play and the way we try to get after it and the way we try to – help our team out, like do our 111th and also just try to do a little bit more. We all got that same go mindset. And some, um, some advanced analytics show that their offensive line is at the top of the league in terms of protection, pass protection so far this season. When you turn on the tape, you're familiar with this unit. What have you seen through three games from that offensive line? Uh, no, they're solid. They're solid. I mean, and they're all, they're all NFL players. They're out there. They're playing good ball. So we're up for the challenge. AJ get that, that pick six and just mm -hmm. being around him so much. Man, it was special. AJ's that's like my brother right there, and it was just a great moment. We was on the sideline, just having fun, just enjoying being in the moment, being where our feet were, just enjoying the moment. And also, AJ he deserves that. You know, like he goes hard day in, day out. You know, and he does that all the time out here in the field. Tips the ball up, catches it. So I mean, it he got the fruits of his labor. So I mean, it was great to see.